Hey guys, I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world one trailer at a time. Today, we're gonna look at a 2021 Solitude 390RK. Might be my most favorite floor plan in the Solitude lineup. This is the Christopher Columbus of floor plans. Uh, it's got a rear kitchen, mow ride pin box, uh, outside kitchen, generator prep. It's got a lot of options. Let's get after it. Right here at the front, we've got that mow ride pin box I mentioned. This goes front to back, three inches. That's a nice upgrade they've done uh, for the late half of 2020, uh, 2021. Uh, molded front fiberglass cap. I know it's dirty, guys. We just haven't got to cleaning this yet. We're on it. Then we have our gen prep in through here. That's an option. It's on this one. So you can slide a generator in there, a known in generator, and it's a lot easier to do that. And then over on this side here, we have our battery hookups and uh, <clears throat> hydraulic fluids and that kind of stuff. 30 bumper paint tanks, one on either side. This trailer weighs just less than 15,000 pounds. Uh, the way they do these barn style doors here really makes for a lot more storage in through here. I mentioned a um, uh, uh, an outside kitchen. That's that guy right there. We're gonna see that. We still have more storage at the back as well. We have a full house filtration system, city water connection, black water flush, your winterizing, your sanitizing, you're draining your low points, you're draining your gate valves, all that in from in here. Uh, I'm just gonna slide that out of the way. <clears throat> 10 gallon gas electric water heater, furnace vent, 50 amp service right through here. I'm just using my cheater for right now. We do have slide toppers on this one as well. That's another option. It's not every one, but it is on this one. Uh, dual axles, guys, uh, Westlake tires, 16 inch eight bolt hubs, nitro fill, and then we have that more ride Cree 3000 in between there. And then check out all this storage here at the back, guys. Opens right up. Uh, we have a tray that we're gonna see here in a second that pulls out. We have a electric cord reel, or sorry, uh, is that electric? Yeah, electric cord, I just couldn't find the switch there for a second. Electric cord reel right through here. This compartment here is actually heated as well off the furnace, which is killer. Coming down the back side, guys, roof ladder, that's cool. Get up on the roof, check your seals. But this is what's really cool right here. Nice more right tray with some really heavy items in through there. Slide it in, you're not breaking your back, a lot easier to do. You know, see how nice that glides in? That's awesome. All right, door side. Just the other side of those compartments. We do have a gas hookup down here, is that right? Yeah, outside gas hookup, that's nice. We have six point hydraulic auto leveling, outside receptacle, the other side there are tires. And we have a more ride step above. Nice and solid to the ground. It is spring assistant, so you don't have to be Hercules to lift this up and in. Lend hand grab handle, main entrance. Our awning uh, comes out about eight feet. It does have LED lights, but they're in the tube of the awning. You have to roll the awning out. They're in the tube there. And then uh, just the other side here, a passer storage. On your left, you've got your uh, central vac kind of, uh, where, you, where you turn it on and off, and where you empty the bag, that kind of stuff. We're gonna try to do this outside kitchen. I haven't done this in a minute, so see how this goes. Pulls out like so. Locks into place. This flips over. No, we gotta undo the strap. Josh, get to work, buddy. Cameraman's giggling at me. He loves it. He loves it. All right. Then we're gonna take this pin out right here. This whole piece should rotate around. Leg comes down. Boom, check that out. You look at that, I got one more piece here I gotta add. Be right back. Oh, it's on that side. Sorry guys, I'm running all over the place here. Got me all frazzled. All right. Look at this, look at this. Right on, you will be the king of the campsite, right? We're cooking eggs, we're doing bacon, we're flipping stuff to people. That's pretty slick, outside kitchen, very, very nice. Let's go have a look inside. Right on guys, we're inside that Solitude 390RK 2021 version. Uh, bed slide, guys, king bed is in the slide, fills up the slide itself. We still got bedside tables though. We still got uh, not U <laughs> we still got USB uh, ports, receptacles on both sides, windows on both sides. Nice window there above the bed too, just to bring in some nice natural light, guys. Uh, then we have our front closet. Get a good look at my cameraman, there you go. Good looking fella, second best guy at the dealership. Uh, all kinds of shelving in through here. 
Another shelf down through there. Hanging bar all the way across. Nice light there as well. Laundry uh, compartment in through here. You could obviously just use this for storage if you want, but if you're using it for laundry, you're pulling these shelves out. TV across from the bed. Look at that, it's on angle, just so you can see it, just at the right angle there. Door side window, jewelry tray down below. Six drawers here built into our dresser. All right, and then we're gonna have a little bit of an ottoman that pulls out of here as well. And compartment through there. Right on. All right, let's head down the hallway into the bathroom. Nice little update in there that they didn't have last year. So I love this. They do. They went to solid surface here in the washroom as well. It used to like a laminate kind of countertop, seamless laminate, but this countertop is very, very nice. Uh, just reflects the light. Very, very durable. Undermount his and her sink. Flat black, uh, you know, fixtures in through here. We got compartments on either side. LED lights around the mirror. Very, very nice. Uh, I give her the old squat check here. Porcelain toilet, of course. All right, lots of space through there. No carpet. No carpet in the bath in the bedroom either. Sunken glass tub. Again, I can sit down, shave my legs if I need to. Um, lots of uh, height, elbow space, shoulder space. We got this linen closet right through here. All right, very very nice. And then it's just closed off with a pocket door here, guys. So you're not like wasting any space. Look at the size of this window here in the hallway. As we come down the hallway, we've we've basically come in the unit here, right? We got a spot to hang our jackets, spot to hang some more jackets. Another one down through here, broom closet. And these will be all our switches and breakers. Good work, cameraman. Nice work there. Now, take a step back, get a gander at what this whole kind of feeling looks like. Uh, we got the sunken living space in through here. We got couches here on either side that both turn into beds. We got big windows on both sides. Doesn't matter where your view is, we got a nice view here. We got theater seats right here. These uh, have nice lights underneath them. They're electric recliners, heat, massage. Uh, and they're facing your TV, which is killer. Our TV itself is big. It fills up, you know, a lot of this wall here with the fake teak wall. Um, radio, spot back through here for like a receiver of some kind. Uh, fireplace, look at that, that looks nice. Give her a different color here, what we got, blue. Camera likes blue, we'll leave it there. Um, no carpet here in the slide, guys. It's all that stitched, uh, stitched together linoleum and then we got some storage in through here. I feel like the wood's a little bit lighter. I think it's a little bit lighter um, than last year. Very close, but a little bit lighter. Right on. We can't figure out how to turn these lights on, guys, in the slide here, so if you can help us with that sometime. There's a switch here somewhere we cannot find, so anyways, can't turn those lights on. Let's have a look up in the kitchen. <clears throat> All right. We got the two bar stools in through here, so we're sitting down, eating breakfast. We can even see our TV from here. Uh, you know, someone's hanging out down there. You're able to talk to them. Very, very uh, entertainment friendly. Uh, we have thicker countertops. These are two inches thick now. Um, well, inch and a half or so, but definitely thicker than last year. Very, very robust. Storage down through here. All right. Oh, I wanted to point this out. This is kind of cool. They carved in holes right here. So you have a laptop right here. Run the cord down through and plug it underneath. Just well done. We do have a receptacle right there. Nice window. I know the light switches for that one. There we go. Storage up through here. Oversized microwave. Love all this counter space in through here, guys. Cupboards, cupboards. All kinds of drawers. Right on. More counter space, guys. All right. Ooh. Split style sink. Very, very nice. All right. Storage. Storage. Nice little backlight in through this one. Look at all these cupboards here down below as well. I know I'm all over the place here, guys, but I'm excited. I know. Cool. 18 cubic foot gas electric fridge. All right, island here doesn't have a sink or anything like that in it, so it's pure prep space. Very nicely done. More drawers in through here. Go. What we got here? Oh, nice. Uh, another upgrade, guys, is they've gone to this insignia uh, full, you know, full range basis, like a household style range. Uh, you can definitely do your turkeys, anything large, and through there, nice and easy. Four burners down below. 
oh, sorry, fur burners here above. Got these lights going on as well. And then here's some pantry space all through here. Got blue lights on the oven. The cameraman loves that. Fantastic fan here above. And I love this. You're kind of in the kitchen. You're kind of in like a perch area. You're looking down into the living space. Big, big fan. Hope you guys enjoyed that. That was a 2021 Solitude 390RK. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel. You can email us here at sales at lazyacres.com or you can call us at 705-833-2539. Thanks guys. Have a good day.